other sandwich places are available. It's on the video. Question four. Solve the equation. Oh, I can't see it. Okay, we've got a stealth, a stealth quadratic to deal with here. 2y to the half plus minus 7y to the quarter plus 3 is 0. Um, you spot that one term has double the power of the other term. So we're, I'm going to do a substitution. I'm going to let t equal y to the quarter. Of course, that means that t squared is y to the, y to the half. That's way of writing a half. Um, we're going to sub it in 2 t squared minus 7t plus 3 is 0. Again, it, it, we don't expect these to be particularly unpleasant. Look for it factorising. 2 threes are 6. If we do minus 6 and minus 1, that would work, wouldn't it? Um, I, don't, I, I am I'm pushing the grid as a thing this year. So there we go. Uh, that gives me 6t squared. So that what I need, I need a minus 6t and a minus t, that's 2t is the factor there, t there, that makes that a minus 1, that a minus 3, minus 3 times minus 1 is plus 3, so we've got 2t minus 1 and t minus, minus 3 of our values, giving us t as a half and t as 3. They're the two solutions. But of course, the question wasn't about t. We just introduced t to make it easier. The question was about y. So t is y to the quarter. y to the power of a quarter is equal to a half. y to the power of a quarter equals 3. That means the fourth root of y is a half. So to undo the fourth root, you would raise it to a power of 4. Y is a half to the power of 4, and y is also 3 to the power of 4, and we haven't got a calculator, but these are actually bad. A half to the 4, that's um, 2, 4, 8, 16, 1 over 16, and 3 to the 4, 3, 9, 27, 81. There we go. That was dead, too, wasn't it? That's it done. Um, it, and that's, that's the thing to look out for with these. Can you do the substitution? to make your quadratic easier. And that's maths.